With spurs and a rope, he makes climbing trees look easy. We first introduced you to Buck and Billy Ray when he attempted to rescue a cat that had been stuck for days. His comfort in the trees started at a young age. We were climbing trees and pushing trees over and building tree forts, but always had a, a real tie to the bush. We grew up out in Yellow Point, my mom, my brother and I, and, uh, and we just had a little shack built around a wood stove, and that's, we just pillaged for firewood, so I learned how to run a power saw at a very young age. I think when I was, uh, you know, when I knew I wasn't a, a, an academic guy uh, through school, I think that I thought to myself the perfect job for me would be uh, walking through the bush. Despite a strong tie to the woods, Billy Ray tried various jobs before he had a realization. It was most important to me to be happy at my job because you spend so much time there. So I went out and bought a power saw. I, went, I remember the day it spawned this, this Buck and Billy Ray's tree service. But the thing was that was most important for that for me was I was happy. I was happy out there. Full steam ahead, head first into whatever he does. Yeah. He gives it 200% no matter what. It's gorgeous. Being a hard worker and a dedicated family man are what his wife Wendy says are two of his most prominent traits. He likes to make his family happy. Me and my wife are best friends and, and, and you know, we've been together a long time. My girl's into soccer, she's on the rep team. My boy's into music. I want to be here. I never had an old man around, so I'm making time. He's always asking, like, whenever he goes out to look at jobs, sometimes he'll be like, hey, Rita, want to come with me? Or, like, he just, he really likes to include everyone and whatever he does. Buck and Billy Ray's tree service started off with firewood almost two decades ago, but it soon progressed into climbing and falling, something that fueled his passion. I tell you, when I climbed to top my first tree, I can't explain the, it's just, it's in me. It's, uh, yeah, I found what I like to do. It was, it was quite a nice feeling, <laughs> to say the least. That feeling inspired Billy Ray to capture his days on video so he can share with others. I initially started it for my kids and for my grandkids to say, this is what Grandpa Buckin did or this is what Uncle Buckin did. He, he cut trees for a living and, and that. But, but this has turned into an interesting little thing. It's cool because other he'll, just asking him without seeing, like, how was your day at work? It's, he, it's the only thing that you can hear is words, but actually having like a camera to like videotape it all, you can actually see what he's doing is really cool. It's, it's impressive. It's impressive to see um, what he does every day and and to see how comfortable he is on the YouTube channel That's and just in, on the camera in general. I, I plant them about a foot apart. Buck and Billy Ray's YouTube channel has over 130 videos and is regularly updated with new ones. But it's not just about his life in the trees. He shares his passion for music. He's in a band with his mom called Plum Chutney. He also has a passion and collection of vintage drums and an appreciation for old things in general, including his old trucks he uses to operate his business. He also uses his channel to spread uplifting positive messages. It's just I ain't into the negativity, I just ain't into it. I like to spread a little message at the end of my YouTube videos or stuff and that is to invest in yourself. I promote self business, people working for themselves and doing those things you want to do. I say it on my channel, you know, you don't want to be 80 years old or 75 years old saying, I should have opened up that store, or I, I should have opened up that hair salon, or I should have done this. Just do it. His positive attitude comes from his own personal experiences. One major life-changing moment was getting wiped out by a falling tree. It broke my back, snapped my leg in half, and it actually almost killed me. That was, that was tough. It just put him on a different road. I think it gives you, everybody probably tells you that when they have a, such a close call like that, they have much more appreciation for their life and their health after. I think a man finds out, and a woman, a human being, they find out how they're doing, you know, spiritually or mentally when the chips are down. That's when I think I, I, how a person finds out how they're actually really doing in life. It's easy to be grateful when the, when everything's peachy keen and the mortgage is paid and then the bills are good and everybody's healthy, you know, so I have a different outlook on life now. You can lie down or you can, you can just take it and get going with it and, and that's basically what I did. 
Billy Ray has spent recent years restructuring his business to eliminate overhead and allow for more time for his family, hobbies, and of course, building his YouTube channel. For Go on Shaw TV, I'm Kelly Robinson. See you in the trees.